I remember it was just kind of the end of COVID times, wasn't it, yeah, Sandra? Yeah, yeah. And you yes. were really, and you were really struggling. Oh, I was really struggling. I really was, and I had polymyalgia at the same time. Yeah. So I was in a bad way. Mm. And so, uh, how, how's your life changed now? So, what kind of things could you do before the? Oh. Uh, Operation. I, what kind of things I, I can you do, do now? Things. It wasn't really do things, but there were. I was so much pain in doing them mm. that I didn't do them. You mm. know, but it just. I knew that it would bring her another pain, so I just didn't do do things. Mm. I didn't go walks. I did. I didn't do a lot of things. Uh, and now? Now I'm fine. Now I'm fine. I'm happy. Mm. My knee is a lovely state. Look at me. I wear shorts. I've got bad legs. I've got really bad pains, but I don't care because. Approach no pain? No pain in my pain, my, or my Me. knee. No pain. Fantastic. Well, the right way I would love you to do it when the time comes, because I know that it will, mm. uh, because you did tell me that, you know, it will get worse. And um, I, I, I would like you to do it, because I've heard so many bad stories about bad knee operations and what happened to them and all that and I, I, I'm just over the moon that I've got you. That's <laughs> very kind of you. I, I, I'm, I boast about you all the time. I go, oh no, I had a lovely surgeon and this, that, look at my scar and I'm always showing it off. Let's see you walking then. Oh, yeah, I can walk, I can walk. Oh wow, you're showing off now. Yeah, <laughs> showing. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I can walk, I can get up and down. You know, I'm fine.